Hi, so I just finished reading the Copyright and American Culture um, piece, and I also read the other pieces and watched the Seal This Film movie, and I definitely learned more about copyright than I ever wanted to. I realized that copyright has definitely gotten way out of control. It was originally meant to encourage people to create, which in turn would encourage others to create because they would get inspired by the original creations, they would learn from the original creations, and they would gain knowledge to create their own pieces. But now it's gotten so out of control that it just prohibits people from creating and from using the past to create our culture in the future. And it was interesting to learn about the history of copyright and how it started with just 14 years and then expanded to 28 and then 28 plus 28 and then the lifetime of the creator plus 50 years and it just shows how it, the copyright has become more for the creators and less for our culture. And personally I think it should just be 28 years with the option of expanding it another 28 years and I think this is because by the time people gain access to your work it's going to be completely outdated like in the first video that we watched for our introduction to writing arts course the did you know video it showed how the information that technical students learn the first year will be half of it will be outdated by their third year and I think that that's a perfect example of why how copyright is right now isn't working for us because by the time we gain access to these creations 50 years later or 70 years later we're it's no longer relevant to us and I think eventually that people are going to just be against copyright even more than they are now and our culture is no longer going to accept that you have to pay for things like music and movies. I think it's just going to, we're just going to feel that we have an, a right to the music and the movies. Um, <clears throat> I think that production companies are going to have to get used to this and adapt to it, similar to like what Jamendo and Hulu do. And I think that they're going to eventually have no choice but to embrace the change and to find a new way to make money off of their consumers. So yeah.